morning, it's Sunday the 6th of March and thanks for joining me today. So I have got 114 grams of melon which is 18 calories, one of these yogurts for 143 calories and I weighed out 200 um, mils of skim milk for the day so I've got my coffee and that milk is 68 calories. So yeah that is my breakfast and I'll catch you all later. So this is my roast beef dinner. I've got 85 grams of brisket for 191 calories. 31 grams of parsnips, it's done in a zero calorie spray for, oh gosh, what's that, 20 calories. 60 grams of broccoli for 17 calories. 45 grams of carrots for 13 calories. 105 grams of cauliflower for 30 calories and my gravy is 46 calories, it's one of those sachets and look, I prepared all this cabbage and I turned around on the other side of the kitchen and I thought oh my god I haven't cooked the cabbage so we would have been having that as well I'll have to use that in a week, I just can't believe it a great big bowl of cabbage and I forgot <laughs> Anyway, I'll still enjoy it. I'm just ready to go swimming. My daughter and I have come here, so yeah, trying to get 20 lengths in today, so wish me luck. I'm having these as a snack now for 65 calories. So it looks like I've got a huge plate of tea tonight. I've got the My Protein World Pancake Mix, which I've doubled up. Um, and that is 368 uh, calories for the mixture. And rather than making them into pancakes, I put it into the waffle maker. So that there is 368 calories. 43 calories for the strawberries. 7 calories for the raspberries. And I've got 8 grams of the groovy food raspberry and chocolate flavour sauce. And that is 24 calories. So... I'm really hungry now after swimming, so I'm really looking forward to this. Just got back from quite a late dog walk tonight. So I got me a nice cup of Earl Grey to warm me up because it's quite chilly out there. That wind is freezing. So, yeah, so it's been a good day. Um, those pancakes, the my protein world pancake mix, I put them into waffles just to try them. I do enjoy them, but you know, they're very, um, you, you, you've got like a aftertaste to them, a bit like, I can't describe it, but I enjoy them and I'll, I'll still eat them, but you can taste like an artificially taste kind of thing. And I noticed it more when they were waffles than I did when they were pancakes, which is a bit bizarre, but, but yeah, so, and my lunch today don't know if you noticed, but I cut out the potatoes out of that today. Um, but I did have parsnips, only yeah. only 31 grams of parsnips. But um, I'm trying this to lower my carb thing. But I'm going to talk about more tomorrow um, of what I've decided to do next. Um, nothing drastic or anything, but just a couple of little changes couple of little tweaks to see if it'll make any difference but um, thank you to everybody that commented on my video yesterday I know I was a bit of a bit of a, a depressing state if that's what you may call it um, and I do get these from time to time where I just feel so sorry for myself and yeah so I do apologize but it's life and it's just how I feel from time to time um, so I really really appreciate all your comments and I will get back to you it's just this weekend has been so hectic we've had so much on um, so yeah let me just have a quick sip it was so cold out on that walk tonight I think it's going to be a hard frost well I wish I wore my gloves really because my hands were like absolute ice. But anyway, so I'm ending the day on 
1,157. So I've got 243 calories remaining. I wanted to try and save some, as many as I could today. Um, and I wanted to try and knock the carbs down as much as possible. Um, I think it's going to be quite hard to get it under 100 myself, but I'll work on it. And as I say, I'll discuss this with you tomorrow. So, um, yeah, so, and I've been swimming, really enjoyed my swimming. I filmed when we were going swimming, and then when we were coming out, we were a bit late leaving, and I had to rush to get home because um, hubby needed a car because we were taking a load of stuff to this lockup that we've got now. And it was all one mad rush, so of course I forgot to completely film again then until tea time. So, but anyway, I, I'll just show you my screen. So breakfast, breakfast, <laughs> speak properly, it was 229. My lunch was 317. It was quite low because obviously I didn't have the potatoes. And can you believe I didn't cook the cabbage? Oh my God. Um, my tea was 442 and then my snacks 169 I didn't film the pom bears but everything else I have filmed today um, so yeah I had a pack of pom bears I think that was before tea when I come yeah I think it was so that is what I'm ending on Um, see, before I had the pom bears, I was just under 100 on the carbs. I don't know how the hell anyone can get it to 50, to be honest. But anyway, so my protein's good. God, I've really gotten into this um, Earl Grey. I used to drink Earl Grey years and years ago. And um, I haven't had it for a long time because I am a big coffee drinker. And then they was on offer, Twine and Zill Grey in Waitrose. And I thought, well, I'll buy a box of those. So, yeah, I do enjoy a cup of that now every day. I'm getting a right old fogey. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's very nice. And, uh, obviously, I try not to drink uh, caffeinated coffee this late in the day. I switch to decaffeinated because my sleep pattern doesn't need any... Um, encouragement of drinking caffeine so so yeah that is my day over thanks so much for joining me again and tomorrow obviously is way day <clears throat> and we'll see what that brings um so yeah there'll be a video with my weighing update and then oh and i'll discuss what i'm gonna do going forward nothing major just a, ch a little tweak or two um yeah, and then there'll be my what I eat in a day in the evening. So I hope you've all had a great weekend. And yeah, and good luck to anyone that is weighing tomorrow. Hope you get what you are hoping for. Um, and yes, I can't believe it's back to Monday again. Where do these weeks keep going? I just don't know. And tomorrow I've got a gorgeous tea. I'm so looking forward to it. I've worked out the calories and I can't remember now without going back on there to tell you. But my daughter's got um, cooking in school tomorrow and they were allowed to choose anything savoury that they wanted. Obviously within the time, time scale that they have got. She looked at doing, um, oh what is it? A beef wellington but that is so high in calories and everything so decided against that so she's going to make her own pizza dough which she's very good at and her own um what do you call it pizza sauce and then obviously her toppings so i am having a homemade pizza for tea tomorrow and i've worked out the calories i just need to work around now what i'm going to have for breakfast and lunch to hopefully not go over hundreds and hundreds of calories on weigh day so yeah anyway i'll catch you all tomorrow and fingers crossed for weigh weighing bye